Hey, what's good guys? Matt here with Tackle Warehouse with another edition of what's new at TW for you guys. Uh, we've got some pretty cool new stuff to show you today, so let's get started. Uh, first one up, we've got a new one from Castaic and Boyd Duckett. This is the uh, BD Glide Bait right here. Eight inch glide, weighs in at about two ounces. A perfect medium size for you know anywhere from California all the way to the East Coast. Uh, so I'm just a little bit different from uh, Castaic and Boyd Duckett. If you're in the market for a new glide bait, definitely check this out. You really do not need five, six hundred dollar glide baits to, to get bit. Uh, you really don't. Um, so if you're looking for something fairly inexpensive, it's still pretty good quality. Definitely check out these uh, the Castaic Boyd Duckett glide baits. Next up, we've got a pretty cool new one from Strike King. This is Strike King Skipping Jig. The unique head design on this thing, it's flat on the bottom here, so it, so it allows you to really get this bait uh, you know, under docks, overhanging trees, anything like that. Uh, it's gonna skip very well because of that head design on it. A couple cool features, it's got a pretty stout weed guard. It's not super stout to the point where it's gonna be hard to get a, a hook in a fish. Comes with a solid, I mean, heavy wire hook. And the other cool thing that I really like about it, I'm happy to, uh, Strike King did, was their screw lock uh, trailer keeper on this thing. If you guys have never used a screw lock trailer keeper, you guys need to check them out. They really do secure your trailers on, on your uh, your jigs or, or your swim bait heads. I mean, I mean, really, really good. You don't have to glue, uh, you don't lose, you know, tear up plastics right away. So new skipping jig from uh, Strike King, definitely give them a look. Next up, we've got a new one from Mega Bass, and I'm absolutely pumped on this bait. This is the Mega Bass Kanata. Uh, as you guys can see, it, it's a massive hard bait. Comes in at almost seven inches. Uh, these things have, are designed with a with two very flat sides on them. And what that's gonna do is that's gonna put, give you a lot of water displacement. Um, these baits are really gonna kick left and right. Uh, these things are a, a slow floater, what they call a slow floater. So they will float upon, you know, before you're, you're retrieved. Once they come down, you bring them down, you retrieve, they'll sit. This bait actually is a little unique in the fact that when, when you pause the bait, it will actually kind of rise this way. So it gives you a little bit different, unique action. If you guys like throwing bigger hard baits, you know, around the time when, when fish are on bigger bait, uh, or these things in salt water for calico, uh, definitely give these things a look. I think this one will be a calico killer. This guy here is just your great bait imitating uh, jerk bait. So definitely give these new ones a look from Mega Bass. Next up, we've got a new one from Raid Japan. Uh, this is their uh, buggy crawl. This thing is pretty cool. It's designed, it's, it's poured with dual density plastics. So you're getting a real meaty, pretty durable bait. Um, cool thing, cool feature about this bait is it's actually got a back sliding action. So if you wanted to toss this thing weightless, uh, if you're fishing around docks and you wanted to get this bait just really, really underneath those, dock, uh, those docks or around pilings, uh, definitely rig this thing up weightless. Uh, yeah, something cool from, from Raid Japan. Definitely check them out. We've got a new one that I know you guys are very excited about. I know I am. I know a lot of the guys here are very excited about these. Um, we, the Imakatsu Stealth Swimmers are here. Uh, if you guys haven't checked these out yet, the super cool design swim bait. Uh, they are completely weedless. They come in at about seven inches. Um, one of the, the coolest feature on this thing is the hook. It's not just a fixed you know, hook in the body like traditional weedless baits are. Um, this thing actually has a counter lever, can, counter levering action similar to uh, what you would see on a snelled flipping hook. So once you once that fish hits that hits this bait and you set that hook, this hook is really gonna, it's going to come apart from the magnet that's in the body, and you're really going to get a, a lot better hookup ratio with these guys. Um, they come in uh, two per pack, one slow sink and one fast sink option. So you guys definitely got options, lots of different cool colors. Give these guys a look. Last but certainly not least, we've got a new one from Storm. This is their Arashi Rattling Vibe. A pretty cool unique thing about this bait, uh, what Storm did with the rattle is uh, it's actually, it's a single pitch, it's not super loud, it's not super aggressive. So it's not really, it's not gonna be intimidating to those fish, especially when they're a little bit, you know, timid to bite, um, the, lots of pressure. Uh, this is definitely gonna be a bait that you would wanna throw in place of, of other, you know, um, lipless crankbaits that have a uh, you know very very high pitch rattle lots of bbs all that um, this is going to be a little bit more subtle and and definitely probably going to get you a little a little more bites so if you guys like uh, lipless cranks ripping through grass or anything any of those sorts definitely give this new one from storm a look thank you guys for joining us today for more detailed information on all the products seen here click on the link or the images below to view everything that's new at Tackle Warehouse, click on the link in the description and be sure to check back with us next week for more of what's new at TW. These are one ounce baits with the well-known war bait style head on them. Great deep spinner baits. The seven inch swim bait with a hollow body 
hook is 100% hidden inside it. The mag slow, you could swim it just a little bit slower uh, and it keeps a nice even keel. It doesn't have the head motion.